All right, Micah, thank you so much. Right now, are you fit and are you financially fit? Well, both will be put to the test for the Junior Achievement of Southern Nevada's inaugural 4.01K. Did I get it? Yeah. 4.01K. <laughs> All right. Race for financial fitness next month. That's right. Here to help us diversify our steps is Caitlin <laughs> Shea with Junior Achievement. Also with us, Ryan Teepin. He's here with Unify Financial Credit Union. It's great having both of you. Morning. 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 <laughs> Before we get into the race, let's talk about Junior Achievement and what it is you do here in Southern Nevada. Yeah, so Junior Achievement is educating about 20,000 students a year, mm -hmm. K through 12, here in Southern Nevada. Um, and we're doing that with financial literacy programming, workforce readiness, and talking about being an entrepreneur and dreaming mm. big. Awesome. How did you guys decide to do this race? Well, it's been a labor of love. We were just talking about this this morning. Um, you know, we were, we were thinking about fi uh, fitness and being financially fit is super important in yeah. today's market. And um, what better way to get out and support a great cause by getting your steps in, like Sean said, um, and doing this race with us on Saturday, April 7th. And mm -hmm. I, I'm down for anything that's not a 5K. <laughs> so if There's a one mile for you, sure, Sean. Don't oh, worry. even better. That's <laughs> yeah. fantastic. I love fun walks. Those are my favorite. Uh, so uh, where and when is this taking place? So it's Saturday, April 7th. Okay. Um, April is Financial Literacy Awareness mm -hmm. Month, Aha. so that's why we're doing it in okay. April. And um, we are starting the race at Hooters Hotel and Casino, and we're going out and down Las Vegas Boulevard and back down Tropicana, so right on the Las Vegas Strip. Wow. Awesome. Yeah. This is pretty cool. I like that. <laughs> you don't get a chance to, to race on the Strip often. It's you either really this do. or it's the Rock and Roll yeah. Marathon. That's it. Yeah. That's right. And New Year's, if you're running around on New Year's. Well, yeah. not, not with those heels. You yes. see the girls with the that's a race for your life. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Uh, Ryan, Unify Financial Credit Union is a participating sponsor. Tell us why you guys got involved. Well, it really is a perfect partnership for us. Um, you know, every day we we're constantly try trying to foster others, foster our members, and helping them better their financial situation. So, when this event came along, and, and, and we're new to the community, our branches, um, it's kind of a perfect fit for us to help our members and also kind of get our name out there and, and, and let people know that we are also here to help them um, with their financial needs. Absolutely, and of mm -hmm. course, being a credit union, you serve your members, yes, sir, and not stockholders. That's right. That's fantastic. That's right. <laughs> here for that. Bravo. Uh, it seems like the younger demo, the ones that you've been reaching out to, they're getting pretty hip to this. Hmm. Financial literacy, whereas maybe my, my you know, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Oh, this is the extra hour sleep. <laughs> I'm right now. Uh, the, my, my generation maybe missed out on that. The 20-somethings hmm. this time around seem to be saving more. Hmm. You know, it's, it's really amazing with the work that we're doing. You know, we're teaching children that at five years old, it's never too early to start saving, right? And it's never too late. So, Sean, you could start saving today, and, you know, who knows where you're going to be in a couple of years. And, you know, our partnership with Unify Credit Union has been really great because their demographic is actually millennials and that young, you know, 25 to 40. Smart. And so I'm a I think, you know, there we go. Uh, cool. <laughs> you awesome. are, Sean, you are. Nice. <laughs> Awesome, fantastic. Yeah. It's awesome. I mean, speaking of, uh, you know, kids learning, it's never, it, it, you're never too young to start learning, right? That's right. I, what, I, I, as far as the school system, like at what ages do you think it's really key to get kind of those basic financial principles in place? Yeah, so, you know, we go into the classroom as early as kindergarten and we talk about wants and needs, right? So a house is a need. Um, a oh. puppy is maybe a want. For me, it's a need, but for, <laughs> you know, for everybody, that's, that's a want. So, you know, I, I think it's never too young to learn and, and we see progress and amazing transformations with kids like thinking about money, um, not being afraid of money, right? Money's an adult thing. No, money's something that we can all learn about um, and all learn how to manage. You know, so I think, I mean, we've seen it as young as five in, in Southern Nevada. I so. think that's wow. terrific. You yeah. are demystifying money management. That's exactly And it. I think I grew up with that situation of like, uh, money is something your parents deal with right. and, you, and, and kids, you don't really talk about it. Exactly. Um, so that's great. That's terrific. If you, if you set up like an allowance for your kid and you say, mm -hmm. all right, uh, this is your money. Right. You, you just factor in, all right, well, how much would I spend on this kid otherwise? <laughs> right. Other than the food that they need. And you save that money, and then you say, oh, you want a Nintendo Switch. Right. Have you saved your money for a Nintendo Switch? Oh, I am exactly. so proud of that. That's the way to do go. That. Yes. Because well, then they can learn the power of them holding off, not getting that candy that they exactly. want then. And after a few weeks, oh my goodness, I might have enough money to get the Switch. Well, yeah. and you always feel better when you've earned something, of right? Course, like yeah. when you've yeah. saved, I think something is so much better, you know, even as adults. I mean, a house, a car, a, a baby. I mean, that's a lot of money, right, yes. Sean? Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, it's so expensive. <laughs>
<sighs> um, <laughs> uh, I know that the, the race is going to be a lot of fun next month, and we mm -hmm. want to make sure that people sign up. We're going to give them yeah. details right now. Yes. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thanks, it's great guys. having you. Great to have you guys. Lace up your running shoes and make strides in junior achievements. Inaugural 4.01K race for financial fitness. It takes place Saturday, April 7th at Hooters Hotel and Casino on TROP just off the Strip. The event kicks off at 8 a.m. To register, go to jalasvegas.org slash events and make sure to use the promo code JARUN. All one word to save $5 off your registration. Nice. The number is also listed. Junior Achievement of Southern Nevada is a proud sponsor of the Morning Blend. See, there we go. Also teaching financial responsibility. Wait for the promo yeah. code. Always. <laughs> yeah. Still to come on the Morning